this month, we're celebrating folks who will stop at nothing to fulfill their dreams. I love it. Today's guest is a woman named Summer Lucille. And when she opened up her own Plus Slice clothing boutique in Charlotte, North Carolina, she found more than a dream. She found her purpose. Welcome to Juicy, where you gotta be two some to do some. Welcome to Juicy Body Goddess, where you gotta be two some to do some. Yeah. Hey, you thicker than a snicker to me. I am Summer Lucille, the owner of Juicy Body Goddess Plus Size Boutique, where you can find your fashion and your confidence. You drop something. Your crown, because you're a queen. <laughs> And thanks to TikTok, the Charlotte, North Carolina boutique owner is spreading her message of fun, fashion, and self-love. When I went viral, I, ah, I screamed. I did a 15-second video of what I normally do, greeting my customers. Welcome to Juicy Body Guys, where you got to be do something to do something. How can I help you? And the next morning, I woke up to like... 300, 400,000 more followers, hundreds of comments and thousands of shares. All my aunties are divas, my mama was a diva, I'm a diva, so we, it's just in my blood. Fashion has always been a part of my life. Oh my goodness, you look so good. Today, Summer says she's living her dream and her purpose, but it was a journey. In 2011, Summer suddenly lost her mother. She was my best friend, so I was devastated. She was such a wonderful person trying to be more like her. I'm sorry. I don't want to mess my makeup up. Come on, Summer. She was somebody that inspired me. She was somebody that helped me find my confidence. Since I was a little girl, she was like, you're chubby. You don't look like the average American beauty, but you remember you are the best in the room. Don't you ever forget that. You are destined to be the most confident person ever walked this earth. And later that same year, she was part of a massive layoff at her corporate job. Losing my mom, then losing my job in a six month span. I was just in such a really dark space. I can sit here and I can use all of my failures, all of my depression, all of my pain, or I can use that as energy to fulfill my dreams and my passion and my purpose. And it just hit me like, boom. I'm just gonna go with what my heart and my desires take me. Then in 2012, Summer's dreams became a reality when she opened the doors to Juicy Body Goddess. My destiny has brought me to Juicy Body Goddess. <laughs> when the door opens, you can expect a welcome to Juicy Body Goddess. So you gotta be two something and do something. I'm able to put women in beautiful clothing. That looks amazing what? on you. I'm able to encourage them to love the body they are in, and I'm able to tell them that they are perfect the way they are. For customers like Lakeisha, Summer is more than just a store owner. I can honestly say she's part of the reason why I am still here right now. As I came into the store, she was like, sweetheart, you okay? I just felt like I did not want to be here anymore. At the time, Lakeisha says she was in a bad relationship. Somebody who's constantly telling you you're not good enough, you're too fat, nobody's going to love you. You actually start to believe it. You just go into this depression. But it took that one time to walk in this store, and my whole life changed. And she called, and she checked on me, she texted me, she made sure I was good. I lost my identity, and Summer helped me find it. And I love her. I love you more. Look, Keisha, don't tell me crying. Yeah, I'm, so <laughs> I'm a queen. She helped me adjust my crown, as I should say. Exactly. That's exactly what she did. To hear that, that just confirms I'm supposed to be here and I'm living in my purpose. Fat is not a bad word. It's not negative. It's fat. It's fine. It's three letters. Don't get yourself worked up with three letters, ladies. And Summer Lucille is with us now. We are so Hello. happy. Hello. Hello, ladies. Hello. Okay, Summer, as we look at you, you are not only gorgeous and confident, but you are resilient. Mm. How did you take all these heartbreaks and turn them into living your dream? You gotta make lemon out of lemonade sometimes. I just took all that pain, that heart, that darkness, mm. and I made it out of something beautiful. And that is inspiring, inspiring and, and encouraging other women um, that look like me, that's chubby, 
that don't look like the standard of everybody else. But you know what? So you I took that, that. You, yeah, you took that shame and you flipped it to almost empowerment, if yes. you will. Tell me about Absolutely. that thing. You, it went viral on TikTok. Yes. That famous greeting. How does it go? Oh, it's it, okay. So you got to drop. You got to drop the G. Okay? okay. Okay. You can't say thing. You got to say thing. Thing. So it's to something to do something. You have to be and that to comes something from, to do something. Yeah, because I'm a plus size. 200 pounds is like a stem, stem, you know, little sting. Or people don't like to be 200 pounds, especially us women. And I'm welcome. Come on in. You got to be 200 to even come on in. So that's where that comes from. You yes, ma'am. You know what else we were just in awe of is we feel like those words that your mom said to you, you're beautiful, you're the, you are special. Like you're now sharing those with the women that walk into your store every day. Do you feel that way? Yes, yes I do. Um, I feel for me to, this is my purpose and to encourage other women and to be more like her, I am keeping her name alive. Oh. So that's why I do this, to keep her alive, to keep, you know, um, other women encourage and have that confidence. So I just want to be more like her beautiful soul and to leave an imprint on, on this earth uh, with um, women and encouraging them and, well, you know, and, she, and providing um, confidence for them and the ones that are weak and vulnerable. You know, she is proud of you. Well, you empower so Thank many women. So much. Uh, some of them wanted to share their gratitude. Take a look at this, Summer. Hey, Summer. Um, I just want to say that you changed my life. You taught me that it was okay to be plus size, to be who I was, to, to love myself. You have a way of getting women to feel and see the gorgeousness that lies within. You have been such an indelible change agent in so many people's lives. I could have never come to that complete understanding of loving myself, um, and I owe everything to you. I love you, honey. I love you, darling. I love you, Summer. Thank you. Oh, oh Summer. My Those are well-earned tears of love and gratitude. How does it feel to hear all of that love that you've thrown out there and then now got back in return? I'm just speechless. It's just, it's just, um, you give, especially being a business owner for over a decade, you give and you, um, you sacrifice so much spending time with your family, spending time with your loved ones, risking your health and to know that it's not all in vain and you're actually changing women's lives every day, um, every day and changing people. Um, it's just, I'm just speechless. It's just a beautiful, that was so beautiful. Thank you so much. Of course. It just, I just know I'm here. This is my purpose. This is my reason to be here. Well, this is my reason. You've inspired, inspired so many women to find their own purposes so today. We're sending you so much love. Congratulations. Keep up the great work. It transcends clothes. <laughs> yes. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's about more purpose. than that. Thank you. Thank, thank you, yes, Summer. Yes, it's more than that. All right. We're all inspired this yes. morning.